instructor for Creativity and Problem Solving in Action, the online course. By now, you've signed on to the Moto course page. And hopefully, you've also updated your own profile because we all want to meet each other in this course. And maybe you've even looked at my profile. So for right now, all I'm going to say about my background is that I have had an interest in creativity for many years now, and I've taught it in many different formats. And I've also had the opportunity to attend SIPSI. I don't know if any of you have heard of it, but it's the Creative Problem Solving Institute that's annually held by the Creative Education Foundation. That's the same foundation that's created the Creative Problem Solving Kit that you have for this class. And I've also had a chance to train at the Synectics Institute, something that will become familiar to you as you read your Davis textbook. Um, I have, as I mentioned, a real enthusiasm around creativity. And I hope that by the end of the course, you will as well. But even perhaps more important to some of you than simply being enthusiastic about creativity is that I'm hoping that you will have developed a whole set of skills that you can put in your toolkit. So many of your co-workers uh, may be as good as you around critical thinking skills, but you will have the added advantage of creative thinking skills. So many times because of the way we're schooled in graduate school, graduate school, uh, undergraduate school, high school, even in elementary school, we become left brain dominant. We become very good at things like one and one is two, doing math, doing rules, regulations, putting things in order. But it's the right side of the brain that is so often neglected in traditional education. And this course will help you develop that side of yourself, particularly when we talk about divergent thinking. And you've already begun, perhaps, reading about that in the Davis textbook, and we're going to learn more about that as we go along. And so join me in watching our next video.